people man welcome back to the channel real quick i'm gonna show y'all how to uh diagnose some noisy st struts okay we're looking for a front end noise a clunk 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 struts coming from the struts now this car has been uh actually come from a dealership okay a dealership and threw some parts at it got new lower control arms on it but i'm gonna show you all a jt hack a uh, simple trick that i employed a long time ago now grab the strut, the core spring, uh, grab it with your right hand, get, find your good position and grab it with your left hand. All you're going to do is simply pull back and forth toward you, okay, like this. Now if you feel a clunk, 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 ladies and gentlemen, that strut is noisy, internally coming apart. Alright, so what I have right here is a one-piece strut assembly. Okay, this cut out a little bit of a... Uh, cut out a lot of work and uh, also a safety issue man I don't have to compress the spring and I don't have to fool with the spring compressor or any of that man but yeah that is a hack I employed a while ago okay I refuse to get burnt twice and this has happened to me actually I remember one time putting in some hub bearings and a lower control arm one time just to find out that the noise was coming from the strut all right now uh to fix this you simply have to replace the strut like i say i have a strut assembly all right we gotta get these strut bolts off and uh of course there is three uh three nuts holding it on the top uh strut tire okay right here so these got to come off and of course the two camera bolt strut bolts have to come off that's fairly easy just simply loosen that grab your hammer bang that out and uh we got to get that off. Uh, that's also a stabilizing link attached to the strut assembly. That's got to come off. Uh, a couple things have to come off to get the strut out of the strut housing area. Okay, so fairly simple. Once you get it out, uh, you just go back in with a new with the new strut assembly that we have supplied. All right. Like I say, that cut out a lot of safety hazards. <laughs> I hate compressor struts, so I got me a complete strut assembly. Assembly. Now, uh, will you have to do an alignment? Some people ask me that all the time. Uh, I would. I mean, it's not really necessary because uh, there's really no camber adjustments. Okay, you have to really go in with a boat kit to uh, adjust the camera. But for now, we're gonna focus on replacing the strut. Like I said, I would do an alignment on it, but if uh, they don't have the money, you. Go drive the car and see how it drives. All right, so I got that loose now. What I'm gonna do is finish getting the top part loose, and uh, we're pretty much there. I will pretty much wrap this up. Uh, once you get these three bolts off, it should fall out from there. Okay, so I don't want this video to be long. Uh, like I say, this is fairly easy. Uh, it's time to come out now so just lower it very slowly and careful move it out and uh, in order to install it just reverse the procedure all right that's all i have man thanks for watching comment subscribe i'll see y'all in the next video